Hey everybody, I'm Chris Provost, you're watching Provost Park Pass, and today is a big, big travel day. I'm going to be taking the bullet train from Osaka back up to Tokyo and checking into my capsule hotel. So you come and join me with this uh, amazing little journey. Let's do this. Okay, the first thing I have to show is I have two backpacks, okay? This is my normal backpack I just carry around the park, and this is my travel backpack. Normally, I take my normal backpack and I put it inside my travel backpack when I'm traveling, like taking a subway or a bullet train or whatever. But if you watched yesterday, if you watched the video of two days ago, I guess, of Universe Studios when I bought all the merchandise for Amanda and Miles, it's literally, see this pocket here? This is all my dirty clothes. This is dirty clothes. <laughs> This is more dirty clothes. I took all my dirty clothes out and just shoved them in these pockets and to give room so that way I can have room for uh, Amanda's and Miles' souvenirs. So yeah, it is jammed. It is jam-packed. There's this. So now I got two backpacks to worry about when I travel today. Just want to cinch these down a little bit more. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. Get them for a traveler. It's a little bit, a little bit tighter. There we go. I think that's pretty good. All right, let's go. And I do have to show the top. You know what the top's filled with? These are all the pins. Those pins that we bought. That we do the giveaway when we do the live stream. If you guys want a chance to win some of these amazing pins, this is simple. We got, we got tons of them giveaway. And we'll be doing a live stream. All you have to do is just hit the subscribe button and then hit that bell notification. I think it's right over here somewhere. Hit that bell notification. That way when we go live, you are notified. And during the live stream, we'll just be randomly giving these out to people. So uh, let's keep those safe. Okay, so I have a little carabiner. And I took that and I clipped it onto the right top of my backpack, which then is clipped on right here. So that way I can go like, hey, huh, backpack is off the side. We'll see if that works. I'm just gonna walk, it feels okay. I'm, I've been kind of walking around like the hotel room. It feels okay. So, all right, let's do this guys. Let's get on a bullet train. Oh my gosh, it's raining so hard. What is it with this rain guys? How do I do this? I gotta get over there. Let's do it. A lot of rain. <laughs> I don't even know, guys. Got backpacks, got rain, trying to get around. We'll figure it out. Okay, I, I am, yep, yeah, I'm in a, a taxi. Hi. Going to uh, Osaka Station. We're approaching the station and getting close. I was just told that we're about nine minutes away from the station. So, yeah. Some really tall buildings everywhere. see the bike and this little rain breakers for children when they driving around the kids it's way up there super tall buildings really tall I think we're almost here we're getting close all right, we're here. I, as I got out, the guy was, hey, hey, and I looked, I left my umbrella in the taxi. So let's do this. All right, we're here in the station, I think right over there, and we have a few minutes. They're selling all kinds of stuff before you get on the train. It's a very busy station. I'm, I got here a little bit early, but I trained up for about another 45 minutes. They have like a little area where you can go sit wait the waiting room, but I'm gonna go maybe try to find some food. I wanted to eat at uh, McDonald's. I thought that'd be kind of fun to do, but the line is huge. I don't know if I have enough time. Okay, so I didn't eat at McDonald's. What I did is I actually got my ticket and went through the gates. Now, because they have like shops and stuff outside. This here now, where I'm inside here, this is everybody who's been traveling. There's all these bunch of different stores here. It's just, you grab some stuff and then take it on trains with you. This is a little garbage trolley and it plays music so you so people know where to go they push it around and you can drop off your garbage there okay i bought a box of food i'll be honest with you i have no idea what's in it at all i don't even know if it's food i'm pretty sure it's food uh because it's like a food place so 
That's what we'll eat on the bullet train. Okay, so this looks a much more crowded uh, this train than the one I came down on. Uh, so I don't want to be disrespectful. Like I'll have to be very quiet or do minimal filming. We'll see. I'll show you the food that I got. Also, when the train comes, you have one minute to get on. And it kind of causes me a little anxiety because I want to make sure it's the right train. We got one minute to get on, and then it takes off. There we go. That's our train coming in. Okay, so here comes our train. You'll see it. Fifteen cars. lot of people getting on it like I'm, I know I know I'm gonna make it but I'm like nervous like one minute gotta get on I don't know why that caused me anxiety or not door number eight that's our door okay we made it on uh, got my bag up stuff up above I got my food here oh take a link from and uh, so far, nobody's sitting next to me. And then me, once the train takes off, I'm gonna show you outside the window. Then I'm gonna show you this food that I bought. Man, they don't joke around. Those trains, like, it's fast. No more taking off already. Okay, we just left the station. And we're just kind of picking up a little bit of speed.
There we, <laughs> there we go. That, um, I'm happy. Had some good food. <laughs> Phew. They're coming by to collect our garbage. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I stood up. I'm gonna can I show you some different carts uh, that, that you could uh, ride in here. And I didn't know this. I bought my thing. I think I got a the different classes, like first class, business class, whatever. I think I'm in the green car. I don't know exactly what class that is, but uh, we'll just go through, take a look at what we have. I bought my tickets online from company. I just bought availability, whatever was available. Areas here for you, well, bathrooms or restrooms you can use, and the doors open automatically for you when you get there. Just stand there, and boom, door opens. And this bathroom is just for men. It's just a giant urinal. For the it's amazing green hills. We just went in a tunnel. There's lots of tunnels. We do this. Guys, that's Mount Fuji. another one. It's estimated that over 10 billion people have taken the bullet trains here in Japan. <laughs> this is when it gets a little confusing to me. I just have to take my time to find what I'm looking for. All right, so I'm walking through the, tra I left the train station. Now I'm walking through the subway station trying to find the right subway to take me to the capsule hotel where I'm staying at. I cannot find my subway station I need to go to. Just looking, looking. But there's a taxi stand right here. I look up the taxi. It's fairly inexpensive. So I'll just take a taxi. Look at this subway station though. It's absolutely beautiful. I made it. 
That's my hotel right there behind me, the nine hour hotel. It's a capsule hotel, which means that um, like the room is tiny, about size, a little bit bigger than like a coffin. I store my locker, I mean, my bags in a locker and I just sleep there. So you see, let me, let me show it to you. There's the nine hour. There we go. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. You need to hit that like button and that subscribe button because uh, tomorrow's video is gonna be this whole experience of what it's like staying here in a capsule hotel. I have no idea what it's like. But before we get to that, I just wanna tell you this. Do you know how amazing you are? You are awesome. You are wonderful. You make the world a better place. Did you know that? And no matter what's going on in the world right now, if you're having a little difficulty, uh, I want you to know that it's gonna going to get better. And the reason I know it's gonna get better because that's what happens. Things in life get better and they get worse. And if you're going through a little bit of a rough patch right now, it is going to get better because you are amazing and you make the world a better place. All right, guys. <laughs> Let's go check in this capsule hotel. You can see this whole video tomorrow. I'll talk to you later. You guys are amazing. Okay, bye-bye. I took a bullet train to Tokyo. I bought a box of food. I didn't know what it was. I tried to eat it, but I didn't know. Was I supposed to cook it or eat it? I didn't know. But it was an adventure. Then I saw Mount Fuji. That was pretty cool too. The bullet train goes fast. Super fast.